This is the Late Round Podcast with your host, JJ Zacharisa. JJ Zacharisa. Sell Josh Jacobs. So after week one, it looked like Josh Jacobs was going to be a workhorse for Oakland. But as we know, they were also in a positive game script throughout that entire game. They ran zero offensive snaps while trailing. Week two against Kansas City was obviously different. Oakland ran 43 offensive snaps while trailing. And that turned into just 12 rush attempts for Josh Jacobs, and unfortunately, zero targets. Now, this is kind of surprising, because Josh Jacobs came out of school as a good pass catcher. He really should be on the field in negative game scripts. But the Raiders opted to use DeAndre Washington and Jalen Richard instead. They combined for five targets against Kansas City. And now, according to Pro Football Focus, Jacobs has run just 21 routes this season. Not only is that outside the top 40 at running back, but that's the same number as Jalen Richard. So what does this mean? It means that Josh Jacobs is a better bet in positive game scripts, but we know that Oakland isn't very good. They're going to face a lot of negative game scripts this year. And if they're not going to deploy Josh Jacobs as a pass-catching running back, that's not good news. That's not good news for Jacobs at all. And upcoming for the Raiders are matchups against the Vikings, Colts, Bears, Packers, and Texans. That doesn't exactly scream positive game script. So right now I think is the time to sell Josh Jacobs.